6 in the morning. We got the Invisalign shoot right now. I honestly have no idea. Everything I see for Invisalign is like a commercial. I'm like, damn, bro, I'm gonna have to like talk on camera. I don't know, I've never done an acting job. This is kind of like acting. I gotta stop being a pussy. Let's go. If you guys saw the last vlog, I was complaining about, oh, I gotta go to Westchester. It's in Harrison, New York, bro. It's only 45 minutes away. To get casted for this, I'm not even gonna lie. They made me do like, sit in your house, play some music, some loud music, and just dance around, act like you're having so much fun. Ah. And they booked me for that, so I don't know. Put your hand to the constellations. The way you look should be a sin. You my sensation. I didn't say a word. I didn't say a word to me this evening. Maybe I should be singing instead of modeling. You know what I'm saying? I got that. I feel like I got that like Ed Sheeran type of voice. Or like some Chris Brown type shit. Yeah. Like some Chris Brown shit. Brought all my pants. I've been in a new designer. Still looking for love. I just hope that I can find her. Rockstar lifestyle. Every night wasted. Drinking out the bottle, baby. I don't even chase it. Every day the same. I've been going. All right, I just made it, but I'm like a little confused about where I'm going. I just hope they're not bugging out about the filming and everything. Everybody's here. I feel like I'm late, bro. They're trying to COVID test me again. Relax. That's true. It's about 10 minutes. <sighs> okay. Hey. Hello. We're just waiting in here. Yes. Yo, I highly doubt I'm going to be able to film during this job, but everybody's wearing masks. And like, they're like, why don't you have your mask? I'm like, bro, you, just, you guys just COVID tested me. I'm about to go in there. I was like the only one back here. Yeah, so when I got in there, they didn't let me film, but yo, they made us jump in the pool. They gave me all these extra, extra clothes. But yeah, that's the crib. Yeah, with the wall. They didn't let me film or anything in there. I get it, it's cause the campaign, but I wanted to show y'all like what it's like to do a job. But the whole time I was there, I was like, yo, is it gonna be a commercial? Uh, you know, like whatever you guys, persona you guys have of me, I don't know, but I was never the video guy. I never wanted to be performing arts, acting, anything like that. You gotta do extremely uncomfortable things to be able to grow in life and anything you wanna do. Cause I literally went from having nothing going on, literally nothing going on. Like when I tell you, I thought multiple times about doing something I shouldn't be doing. I'm not lying. My close friends know how bad of a state I was in before I started doing this. And I don't have the worst story of all time. I'm not gonna see here, oh, I need sympathy. No, I was in a horrible position and then you put yourself through these, all these obstacles and you progress. All right, I'm gonna stop talking motivational. I'm not even trying to sound motivational. I don't even know why I have to keep checking myself. I don't wanna be checking myself. Everybody's talking about, oh, you shouldn't be arrogant. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be overly self-confident man fuck that shit bro you gotta be overly confident in yourself that's the only way who else is gonna be confident in you if you're the most confident person in the room people look up to that shit but they don't want to say nothing the people cower away they try to look at it as negative yo last thing hold up because people will be like oh i want to be a motivational speaker i don't give a fuck bro i don't give a fuck i want to get the listen i want to get the most money the most capital the most power i possibly can right now and then I'm gonna help my people through the way. Your whole, you know what your whole focus should be? Yourself. You gotta put yourself before everybody else right now. If you're 20 years old and you don't know what the fuck to do, who's gonna get you out of that shit? No one. So you gotta, you gotta, you, you gotta up your shit. You gotta be on that shit yourself. Don't be blowing me. Oh fuck you for being selfish. Nah, bro. Think about what I said from a logical standpoint, from what actually makes sense, and then tell me if it makes sense. Just think about it. Think about it. But now we out. Good. Yo, I love the hats. Every week. How are you? Name? Tristan. Last name? P A I N E. Yep. What's up? This is the diesel van we at right now. Yeah, we outside. Yo, my boy Kojo invited me. They do like three of these. They did like three of these already. The fish in here are crazy though, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm gonna have to jack one of these towels too. These, one of these towels coming home with me, guaranteed. Good.
Trying to do this after the photo shoot is just crazy, bro. I'm dying. I feel dead, but we going Listen, I'm here for y'all. Y'all, y'all want to see this type of fashion stuff going on? This is the parties you guys want to be at. So. Yeah, wow. You doing, Cranberry tequila. I right, appreciate you. Yo, I gotta make this entertaining. I'm gonna ask the girls in the pool if they wanna be in the video. And yeah, he got a curse. Did you get them to show their I'm butt? I'm about to. Stuff? You should get them to show their butts. Yeah, that, yo, I was in the process. We in the process. Look, he just stole my shit. <laughs> oh my god. Gonna bite you he for stole my body. You got a people box? Hey. That's what you guys want to see, I know. The little horny middle schoolers that watch this shit. That's why you guys be clicking on the thumbnail, trust me. I know y'all are catching on. You guys know what's going on. Hey yo, this ain't no water feel wearing. I just gotta get some fits for you guys to see because there's not a lot we can film here. It's like everybody's tipsy, everybody's drunk right now. We trying to make it work. Look at my eyes. My eyes are good, we good. But let me get, let me get, let me get some people for you all Okay. Who's are crazy. Day. It's on a chill day. It's on chill a chill day. day. Chill we day. always on a chill day. You know what I mean? Alright, we better go on a mission to find Jess. Rad as fuck. I can't see shit with this light in my face. I'm just walking into nothing right now. And yo, I, I hope I recorded and y'all could even hear me because if I didn't, if y'all can't hear me, I recorded all this shit for nothing. Bro, no cameras, bro. Yo, this guy got to chill. Yo, bro, no cameras, bro. I'm talking about that, bro. <laughs> chill, right chill. Come on now. Bestie! <laughs> I love it. Oh, they haven't seen the backpack yet. Oh, it's new? No, I've had it for a minute. Right. Oh, we gotta get some before we leave. Like, you gotta take something. We need like a towel or a bag or something. Or a pillow. I gotta jack something. We came here, we leave it with something. I probably said something like 15 times in that last sentence, but we gonna take something. Balls. Um, gonna go steal some balls? We're gonna go yeah. steal some balls. Yeah, we'll be back. I don't know about that. Can you get a photo? Yeah, it's a video, but. Oh, <laughs> oh it's a video. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey. Big trip. Like, are you by the booking machine? I got photos of you over there. This is how you know. I don't know what you know if you know like this, but if you know, you know. Dun, dun, dun. You know, push a T. But yo, look. Oh, I'm, I keep gotta flash myself in the face. I was about to take the ball, but I couldn't deflate that shit. So look what we got. You guys can't see, but we got the towel. Diesel towel, diesel towel. Yo, if you guys want, we got the towel. If you guys want, hit me up on Instagram, at Tristan Payne underscore. I'm gonna sell it for five bands. Maybe I'll give you guys 10% off if you guys really fuck with the videos. Use code Tristan Payne. And shout out to Kojo, bro. Kojo was the one who invited me. Love the people out here, bro. It's just always good ass people. I started these videos at the perfect, at the perfect fucking time, so. I'll see y'all in a bit. I woke up in paradise. Would you be my sacrifice? Yo, this is obviously the next day. Only reason I'm filming is because we got some like, I gotta do like this underwear casting, which is horrible. But I think it's gonna be funny because I haven't been to the gym in mad long. I've been slacking, bro. I've been slack. You guys know I've been slacking. Been slacking never slacks though. I actually been slacking. Like, I'm not in horrible shape, but. But always remember guys, body positivity, even if you're fat as fuck. If they don't bug me, I'm gonna call them body shaming me we're body positivity activists today it's all jokes bro relax or is it sorry thank you Welcome. yo you saw that elliot Choi video stuck in the elevator that's the thumbnail for today about to take off my shirt and go naked in this elevator oh shit. let me chill hello 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 oh is that oh sorry there's so many rooms, I was like, nice Tristan, nice, nice to meet, to meet you too. Oh, 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 I just film YouTube videos. <laughs> you do a lot of your YouTube channel? Yeah. Oh, cool. I film fashion and vlogs and stuff like that. Alright, have a good day. Thank you.
Thank you. Damn, bro. I'm not gonna lie, I was kinda happy when we pulled up. We're good. Hey. I was like, fuck, I really gotta put my fucking shirtless in the video. And then he made me move to the corner. I don't know, we all have to blur it out. It's not Pornhub. Girls that wanna DM me, you know what I'm saying? Hit me up. But any tamales that wanna touch my tamale. Ooh, tell me that wasn't fire, bro. Come on. I could really give y'all like a whole splurge freestyle. I think I'm gonna have to come out with some mixtapes soon. I haven't been talking much about the modeling stuff and everything, but if you want to go in there, you want to stand out in the casting, regardless of what you look like, you have to be personable. You have to be very confident in yourself and talking around to groups of people. Like, I'm probably gonna speed over the conversation I had with all of them, but I was talking to them for a good 20 minutes. If I just pulled up, I went to the casting, took the shots, and then left, they'd be like, okay, that's one of the models down, you know? You don't really stand out. You gotta talk. You gotta be showing that you really have a good personality, because it's not just about what you look like. They're gonna be on set with you. They wanna be on set with people that they like to be around, that they like to talk to. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, like I'm, I'm being straight up real with all you guys. I booked three jobs so far. Three, that's it. So it's not like I'm out here booking Louis yet. We on the way there, but it's not yet. All the top models that I know, bro, I know, I know some of the top, top models. And they be saying the same thing. Just force yourself to talk more. Even if you feel uncomfortable, just force yourself to talk more. And don't be one of those guys, yo. If, you, if you're one of the guys asking about the modeling stuff in the, in the comments and all that shit, and then I'm telling you what to do and you want to act all pussy or act all scared and not do it, use asking just to ask, don't be that guy. Actually do it, put in the work, stop being lazy. I don't know, I just be getting mad because I know way too many people that do that type of stuff. Like so many people in my town, I'm not even sneak dissing nobody, it's just people love talking about shit. They love sitting in a room talking about, oh, what if we did this, how would we do that? And then they don't do shit. It's the same bullshit excuses all the time. Like, they don't, no one wants to put in the work, bro. They want an easy route to the top. Don't be one of those people, please. I wasn't even gonna do a corny outro, like, love you guys, this and that, but appreciate y'all for putting me in a position where I can do what I love to do. So, love y'all. Bye.